Hi guys, Christy here. Today for my video, I wanted to show you guys a Christmas look that I created for the holidays. I really hope that you guys enjoy it. I really like this look. I think it's super easy and simple to do. If you guys are interested on how I created this look, then keep on watching. I'm going to start off by priming my eyelids and if you guys are wondering all the products and tools that I'll be using throughout this video as always I'll have them listed on the description box below for you guys so feel free to check that out so once that's done I'm gonna go ahead and set my primer with this little nude matte shade by the Carly Bible palette which looks like this and I'm just gonna go ahead and put it all over my eyelid this also brightens your lid so that the other colors that you apply on top will be brighter and will pop more once I'm done setting it, I'm going to go ahead and go into this little taupey color and I'm just going to apply this on the outer corners of my eyes, kind of shaping like a V-shape. And then using a blending brush, I'm going to go ahead and blend it out. And I like just to keep applying it to, to make it as dark as I want it. So I just keep repeating this process until I like the way that it comes out. With the same taupey color, I'm just going to go ahead and bring it in a little bit closer. So it has that little smoky eye going on. It's okay if you get a little bit messy with your eyeshadow because that's an easy fix. You could just fix that with foundation, which I will show you guys in a little bit. Next up, I'm going to grab the same shade and just apply it right about here. So everywhere else where you did it darken kind of like the middle over to the inner corner just because I want the other shade that I'm going to apply to pop a little bit more and apply this really pretty gold eyeshadow exactly where I put the light shade and then with the pointed blending brush I just go ahead and blend out my crease and it makes it look really natural with the flat foundation brush I'm gonna go ahead and put foundation onto the tip of it and I just make a really straight cut and connect it from the outer corner of my eye to the really tip of my eyebrow so I really like doing that little trick with the foundation because it really looks like you try hard with your eyeshadow and it looks like you did it really well Another really good trick that I like doing to kind of not make it look so dark right below my eyebrow is using this Wet n Wild Ultimate Brow Highlighter and I just apply it under my brow just a little bit because I think a little bit goes a long way and then I'm just going to go ahead and blend it out. Then next up to kind of add a transition color because I feel like it really does not look natural I'm going to go ahead and get this shade on the Carly Bible palette just lightly and then mix it with this shade and then I'm gonna go ahead and blend that out even get a little bit taupey color and then just blend it out before I move on to my lower lashes I'm actually gonna go ahead and grab this really light color from this palette like I said I'll be writing all tools brushes and products on the description box below for you guys so don't forget to check that out if you guys are wondering what I'm using it's just gonna be really simple pop it in and then I'm gonna go to my lower lashes and grab that taupey shade again from the Carly Bible palette just so that it kind of completes the eye look to make everything like really really pop I'll be using these really sparkly colors so to begin I'm going I made this like little DIY because I do not want fallout to be all over my face because this palette is like really sparkly and I'm just going to go ahead and grab this shade right below the gold. And then I'm going to apply it exactly where I put the gold shade. This is just to add a little bit more sparkle to the look. And then going back into Physicians Formula, this little all-in-one highlighter, I'm just going to go ahead and grab these two colors, mostly focusing on this one and then apply it on my brow bone. By the way, if you guys are wondering, this is the highlight that I'm using all over my face. Then next up, I'm just gonna go ahead and curl my eyelashes and apply mascara. As for my lips, I'm gonna go ahead and moisturize. Next up, I'm going to be using for my lips this really pretty color from Palladio and it is called Red Rose and I think this shade is just so perfect for Christmas. 
So I almost forgot to apply eyeliner. I would normally do this before I curl and add mascara to my eyelashes, but since I kind of forgot, I'm going to go back in and apply it. I'll be using this eyeliner from Physicians Formula. Look at the packaging. It's so cute. Onto my lash line, really, really super tightly close to my lashes. Kind of like I'm coloring it in. And then I'm also going to apply it onto my waterline. Alright guys, so this is the final look. So that's it for this video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, don't forget to share it with your friends. Also, if you haven't already subscribed to me, please do so. It would mean a lot. Thanks again for watching. Happy holidays, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!